Hey guys, so I feel like it's been forever since I filmed a video, and I apologize. Ipsy's here. Let's do this. Ooh, it's got like weird, they look like eggs. First thing I'm pulling out is this by Bare Minerals, and this is Marvelous Moxie. This is a lip gloss in the color Rebel. Oh, this is a pretty shade. This is really pretty. It's like not too bold, but kind of a neutral pinky shade. Next up I have these two samples and this is from Chlorine. Smoothing and relaxing patches with soothing corn flour. Oh okay, these are more of those patches that you just put under your eyes, I guess for a specific amount of time. All of these directions, okay no. I was going to say, all of these directions are in like different languages and I can't find one of them in English, but here's one. Remove the film, apply under the lower eye, leave on 20 minutes, then remove. I know another beauty box had these as well. Not this particular brand, but the same like item, like the patches that go under your eyes and are supposed to help relieve puffiness and help you relax and blah blah blah. So I'm going to have to try them since they are seeming to be popular. There's probably something to them. And I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but a lot, not all, but a lot of the things that like I'll see people talk about consistently or will show up in multiple beauty bags, it's for a reason. It's probably a good product. Next, this is something by Be A Bombshell and this is eyeshadow in Bora Bora. Oh, this is pretty. This is a really pretty quad. Okay, and what looks like my last item is by Nicole, by OPI. This has to be a nail polish, and this says, A Gift For You, On What Grounds, by, OP, by Nicole, by OPI. It says that it's a top coat. Hmm. And that's it. It's all empty. Those are all the items that I received in my Ipsy bag. I love Ipsy. I'm telling you that. I've said that from the very beginning. Not every bag blows me away, but Ipsy in general blows me away. The item I must say that I am most excited to try is this lip gloss because it's something that I could wear every single day and not worry about it. It's not a red. It's not like a, like a really nude nude where I'm like, oh, is it starting to look? I'm really excited to wear this color. And that's it. I thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.